No matter where or how money changes hands, the same basic principles apply. Oh, nice. All right. I know. That ain't too exciting. All right, I call. Doesn't particularly have a help at the moment. Forgive me, it's all I can afford. Let's start with this. Gotta step up sometime. Are we playing or what? <laughs> That's not good if he's calling it. Sure. I'm not actually losing out on much, am I? So if he's got something good though, if he's doing that. I'm going all in. What else has he got? Saw that. Um. Ha! Not bad, huh? Damn! What the hell? You're lucky there. Oh, damn you! Yeah. Did I win? That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I won. Because <laughs> he had. He had the two and I had a three. Whew. I was nervous about that one. No, I'm done. Sorry, Charles. That was Blackjack. Fun, the next I, think one. I'm going to I don't even know where I can play Blackjack yet. I've not seen that. Um anyway. I was gonna I was on my way over here until I could play poker and I had a thing to win poker, so I got a bit distracted and played some poker. <laughs> um Ledger. I wanted to look at the crafting tools. Because I can't I actually make any of the I make no apology for it. things yet. Um, it's not this, is it? Craft munitions. Cambodian. Oh, it's this I need. $225? I don't have that. <laughs> I definitely don't have that. So we're just gonna um, hold fire on that one. But that's what I need, because I need that. Right, I'm gonna go see Mary um, before Dutch. Because I don't know if the Dutch one will... Well, I suppose I have to do both, because they're all main stories, but... Um, I feel like the... Oh, I forgot I had that. I'll just get rid of this one. It's poor because I got it with my dead eye, but hit it loads. Let's just get rid of this. Like I'm still drunk. They had a party last night. I didn't record it, unfortunately. <laughs> so I wasn't like aware it was going to happen. So it was to celebrate Sean being back. Um, they had a party. Uh, get rid of this. Sure. It's crap. Might as well make some money off it. Um, I don't actually need the food right now, but I'm just gonna get rid of it. Don't you overcook this now, Pearson? I'll keep that stuff. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Thanks. Where's my horse? <sighs> so I'm not sulking anymore because you guys have told me that um, Come on, girl. the old pelt that I thought I'd lost permanently has just gone to the tracker, the legendary one. So I'm feeling happier now. <laughs> I was really annoyed with myself that I did that. Um, 
But I couldn't have found him anyway. I have no idea where he was. He wasn't on my map, and he was originally on my map when I like saved the the time before. So don't know what happened there. Um, but um, I'm pretty happy now that I know that he's got it. I just missed out on the money for selling it. I used to do some hunting. First, we're gonna go and see Mary. I'll try and get some perfect skins on like rabbits. I guess I'll have to probably try and sneak them because there's no way I can get a headshot from horseback. <laughs> so I'll probably have to try and sneak and track them and do it that way. But I'll probably do that outside of the videos because it will take me forever and won't be very interesting. What kind of deer is that? I also want to try and find that treasure because I think, uh, where else was I? Where was I? I can't remember now. Um, I was over here somewhere, wasn't I? I'm wondering if it's this place. So I think I might go to this little homestead and then look around from here to see where things might be looking like the treasure map picture because I don't think it was where I was where I got the map because he was in the wrong place. So I was going to head there and just see if I can figure that out at some point. But that probably won't be on the channel because I'll forget. <laughs> I'll be like, oh yeah, I need to do that. And I need to find a book for Hosea. He, um, he wants a... I don't think I did that. I think I, that was one of the things I found whilst just wandering around the camp. Um, he wants a book, but I have no idea where to get it. It didn't give me like any prompts. There's no bookshops in Valentine, so I have no idea. So if anyone knows that where that is, that would be um, great. I don't want to look things up online because, you know, it's danger of spoilers. <laughs> it's risky. So, Mary. I like her flower garden. Pretty. Is she here or is she in the... We loved once and true. Two. Yes? Oh, I'm sorry I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton? I also changed my outfit, as you've probably noticed. He's looking very suave and blue. Hello, Arthur. Hi, Mary. Not her outfit. Mary. I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Where's, um... Where's what's-his-name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh, well, you've been, <clears throat> you've been made a widow and you come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Ah, okay. Listen, Arthur, I, I'm... My family. I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. I always liked Jamie. At least compared to the rest of them. <laughs> He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life. Me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... but I 
I think of you often. A long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? Where is it? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, <laughs> I, I think. The rancher there I'm said Mama he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest. Arthur, but I just want him back, quest. Arthur. <laughs> if you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. Yeah, I'm not, um, um, yeah. She rejected All Arthur. Right, girl. What a flat. <laughs> uh, how far away is that? Where is it? Whoa, that's miles away. Why is it flashing? Um, I wonder how long it would take me to get there. We'll go up there. I'm gonna go do it. I just don't know how long it's gonna take me. <laughs> So if it takes me ages, I'll pick up there. <laughs> oh hey, you there! Think you can help a lady out? It depends if you're gonna try and steal my horse my like the horse last guy. My horse died on me, twisted my ankle, something fierce. Think you could give me a ride? Yeah, sure. Hop on. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. <laughs> I am mistrustful. You know Emerald Ranch. Mind taking me there? Sure. All right. Yeah. Glad I ran into you. Huh. I raised that horse, you know. Raised it since it was just a foal. Hmm. Oh, losing a horse is hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah. That horse did right by me. Better than my husband, truth be told. That fool. Always complaining. But does he do something about it? Man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away. Aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage for me has been nothing but trouble. But Sorry Biscuit, to hear that, man. he was a fine animal. Aw, who else his name was Biscuit? Smart, brave. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. <laughs> had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once. I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off. But I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Way to Kicked his hide too as he was hollering away. Yeah. Didn't Ooh, think a man it. could run so fast. Oh yeah? Yeah, had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <laughs> so, you live at Emerald Ranch then? For the time being. I was looking for work. They was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. In what I'm way? Sure. The owner's a mean bastard. Strange, too. Delights in bullying folk. There's a daughter, but she never leaves the house. You can see her in the window sometimes. When I asked about her, everybody told me to leave it alone. Found an old saloon there. All shut down now. But I went in to have a look, and there's bullet holes, old blood stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an uncomfortable feeling to the place. Either way, it's time I left. Especially now I lost that poor horse. I'll collect my belongings and be on my way. Back home. What am I riding into? I guess. <laughs> I bet my husband's right where I left him. Bottle in hand. Well, you seem like you know what you're doing, yep. so I would just not go home, personally. Doesn't sound like the most ideal situation. Um... Being kicked by my dog. 
rude. Am I almost there now? I could have probably just cut across the countryside, but I was interested in their conversation, so I thought I'd follow the road. Is it that close there, or is it further? It's not that close. How far is it? I haven't actually looked. How far is she expecting me? Oh, it's not too far. So have I been here? It doesn't ring a bell. Apart from the fact that I saw it on the sign on the loading screen. Because I was thinking, oh, a rat. Do they have horses? <laughs> As in ones I can have. Is it that one over there? Oh, we're getting close now. Yeah. Oh, this is... Is this? I think this is where I picked up a wanted level. Maybe. Where is it? Yeah, because there was um, a debtor sitting over there, I think. And I Here we go. some guy. This is great. This was kind of you, mister. Please take this as my way of thanking you. Cheers. <laughs> Appreciate it. <laughs> My well, honor is so today. high. Yeah, I don't know if I can do anything here. But this is where I picked up my bounty. Because <laughs> there was this person sitting here and I had to beat him up and then I looted him. And these guys riding through were like, oh, you're a bad man. <laughs> and I didn't react quick enough. Right, so where does that put me? Kind of taking me past it. Okay, so now I'm gonna go up here. <laughs> okay. Might not be too far. Yeah. We'll just follow the road. Alrighty, we are almost there now. It's just around this corner. flower here that this is sage is but i'll need to experiment to. with more of it before yes, i can Jamie. be sure of its effect that is where we are heading yes i Jamie, found this we are one with his friends in the woods i it's checked the wooded areas for more that sounds wonderful it is wonderful Jamie. let's try it really wonderful my father i'm like father listening to him but also Jamie. him hmm. paradise oh yeah it's in the mountains i feel ready to take on the world when we get I'll have trouble sleeping tonight. Right a man can go for days Together. on this. You've had Together. some moments, I'm sure. Some sage may just be what you need. Shalom. 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 You've been a great help. I'd like to give Shalom. you this recipe as a sign of appreciation. Thanks. Shalom. Shalom. Oh, should I have to take it? <laughs> I was uh, watching them again. Prepare this for long journeys. Special horse and hold on thing. tight. Your horse will never want to stop running. Now, if you don't mind, I'll be getting back to my studies. I look forward to our next meeting, traveler. Sage, come carrot. Okay. Oh, that was uh, useful, I suppose. Wait. Gentlemen! Well, you guys stop walking towards the edge, please. Hello. Shallow safety. Shallow safety. Shallow safety. Just 
speak to the boy? Arthur? Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. The path to truth. Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Good. Arthur, I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. I will what hogtie path you. Have you chosen, sir? I'm still searching, I guess. We are all searching. Chelonianism is about searching. What do we search for, do you think? I can't get my lasso out at the moment. I don't know. Safety? Safety and meaning? Jamie knows the truth. But of course, you may speak with him. Exactly. If your teachings are so great, what harm can I do? <laughs> I'm... I'm Jamie. not... I'm not coming with you, Arthur! Just come and speak with Mary, then make up your mind! Oh, damn it. Leave me alone, Arthur! Where's my lasso? <laughs> Come on, Gertie, we've got a chase to do. I'm not very good at this whole lasso thing, though. <laughs> They're always Christ so much faster sakes, than me. Jamie, just hold up a minute. I was doing just fine by Whoa! Seriously? Stay on the road, jackass! That wasn't very helpful. There was nothing I could do to react to it either. I don't even know where Jamie went now. I lost him. I'm gonna have to redo it. <laughs> He's just gone. Somewhere up ahead of me is a yellow dog. I got well big head start for that. Little car. Am I even catching up? Is that him all the way over there? That time. <laughs> I don't even have a clue if I can catch this kid now. Oh. There was nothing I could do to that. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Bloody, bloody car. Worst timing ever. Sister's worried about you. I'll have to answer to you. Sorry. They're just using you. Telling you what you want to hear. What the hell do you know about it, Arthur? Yeah. I know a lot about it. They're my friends! 
<laughs> you will not shoot me. You ain't no killer. You don't know who I am. Seriously, how are you supposed to catch up with this guy? Are you actually shooting at me? Jamie! meant to be able to catch him. Okay. Please, Arthur! I'm a man now! I, I, I found something! A calling! You're just a kid! You're making a big mistake! I'm not taking advice from you! You're an outlaw! You leave me alone! They're good people! I'm warning you, Arthur Morgan! <laughs> leave me alone! Please, kid. Put that gun down. I warn you, Arthur. I'm... I'm gonna... I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone. Oh, no. I'm not doing this again. Now calm down. Does that work? I did it the first Go time! Forces. I had no idea what I did. Okay. <laughs> okay. My heart went super like, oh crap. Okay, kid. Whew. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? A little bit. A little bit, Jamie. I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know. There ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I missed you, Arthur. Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. That's all a long time ago, son. Yeah, I think she irreparably ruined that one. Well, right. This wasn't how I thought today would turn out. Yeah, it's me neither. It's been a long time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I saw you. You didn't try to kill yourself. You know, you taught me how to ride a horse. Well, yeah, I was about to say that too well. Really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. I'm sure. Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. Jesus, Jamie, come on. I just wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtle. Shut up. All Father kept telling me was, you won't amount to anything. Well, your You're father not enough sounds like a jackass. I had to get him. away. I couldn't take it anymore. Forgive me, but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen to him. Hey, don't talk about him like that. What do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father. Nice man. He won't be happy I saw you. Please send him my worst regards. <laughs> thing is, he's right. I'm not good at anything. Come on, that ain't true. Tell me something you like. Uh, well, uh... Don't think too hard. Apples, I guess. Apples? Yeah, I love apples. Okay. I was thinking more along the lines of carpentry or horses or something, but... All right, go work in an orchard then. By that token, you must really like shooting and robbing people. I only like shooting young idiots who run away from me when I'm trying to help them. Father told me what you do. I'm sure he did. Hey, are you still with Dutch and what was his name? H Hester? Jose. Jose. Yep, still the same, sort of. And Annabelle and Bessie? I'm afraid they're dead. Shit. You say they didn't Maybe back. Mary did make the right choice. No doubt, but none of it is anything like the nonsense you read in the newspapers. So, are you two getting back together? I told you, no. Just ask me for a favor. You know Barry Linton's dead? Pneumonia. He told me. So the door's open, so to speak. That's all in the past. For different people now. She's not, and you seem just the same. <laughs> well, maybe that right there's a problem. She was always too good for me. Here we are. She must be waiting inside. Uh, where's the door? Up there. Make 
make it quick or I might run off again. I'm going in. You better not run off again. Father's been very sad. My father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. I'm taking you back. Bye. <laughs> So where's Mary live full time? I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. Saved her brother from a cult, and she's just like, Oh, you'll never change. Poor off. <laughs> I'm pressing her. <laughs> and my Arthur. I feel like the luckiest man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god awful fool of myself once more, but. Somehow, I imagine I shall. Probably. Probably. We loved once and true. What did I have to do for that one? Return Mary to Jamie within two minutes. Oh. Well, I never get those ones when you have to do it within a time minute. Please we convince the Chinians to let you take Jamie. I wonder what would have happened then if I'd, um, kicked up a stink. So I'm assuming this guy isn't in here. Holy Dang, Jesus. you've been gone a while. Where's the book writer guy? Hey, what's that hand? Weren't you the one in here talking to that feller with yeah. Jim Boy Calloway? Yeah, what will right. it be then? More like Jim Drunk Old Man Calloway. <laughs> sure seems that way. What's this thing? Who are you? Hey, mister. What is he doing? Fillet. You game? A five finger fillet. Okay, I'll play. All the details. Uh, test carriage and coordination. To play the game, you place one hand, outstretched palm down on a table, and stab a knife back and forth between fingers, aiming to move quickly and avoid stabbing your hand. Uh oh. The sequence of buttons, one tap, will be displayed on the screen. Press the buttons as fast as you can to perform the knife stabs between the fingers. You will stab your hand if you press the wrong button or has to for too long. At the beginning of each game, you have to place a bet. If you win the game, you take the betting pot, and your opponents will raise the betting stakes and the difficulty. Press X to take them on. Hold circle to leave the table. Three game variations. Classic Guts and Burnout. Each is a different objective. Perform an objective better than your opponent would win a round and win two rounds to win the game. Prior to beginning a game, you can play up to, end, up to three practice attempts to sharpen your skills before taking on the opponent. Press square when prompted to practice. Best attempts are saved, so try to beat your previous record scores. Learn the sequence of buttons by watching your opponent play. Hold R2 during their turn to get a good look. You can show off your skills by performing knife tricks each time you complete one full lap. The L1 button will appear. Press it whenever you're ready to perform a trick. You will sometimes perform a trick while sp spiking the knife into the table at the end of your turn if you perform especially well. Okay, so classic. Set number of laps in a faster time than your opponent you get five attempts if you fail an attempt the timer re reset you start from the beginning guts game most laps in 20 seconds burnout complete the most laps in 30 seconds with no mistakes 
Mm. Let's see what this is like, shall we? Three practice attempts. Oh, seriously? So I've got to be like... Doo, doo, doo. Ah! Okay. My bad. <laughs> oh, I get it. Jeez, I'm not going to break into this! Okay, okay. Oh no, and it's gonna be. Oh, okay. Alright. Um, let's, let's try, I guess. Feeling good. X and circle. X and circle. X and circle. Oh shit! I had to do it twice. <laughs> okay, X and square. X and square. They stop watering the drinks down. <clears throat> now watch this. How to be Frank. Give me that dollar. I'm taking what's left of my fingers and getting out of here. <laughs> That's so bad. That is so bad. Uh, well be some extra money. No, thanks. Bye, yeah. <laughs> Next I'll time, come back to you. Yeah, he'll come back for that. So you where is our meeting going? And then skedaddle. I'm by it. I'm leaving. Thanks. It's fine. Someone's gonna help a fella out. I would if I know where you were. Somebody, please. My horse tied up, can it not leave? I got real bad nerves. I can't work. Can you give me some money? Oh, is it this guy here? Is it you, hollering? Hey, brother. I'm too old to get a job, mister. Way too old. Can't we be friends? <sighs> sure. I'm so happy. I ain't had a friend in a long oh, time. Oh, bless him. Long, long time. My last friend died. Weren't my fault. They said it was, but they was wrong. It's fun being with you, mister. Can I hold you a second, mister? Can I? Um... <laughs> okay, just... Quickly. <laughs> that felt good. It's nice to be held sometimes. Oh, we used to hold each other in the war. How are you doing? You got sad eyes, mister. Like you've seen sad things. Remember with kindness. Are you done? No. That was random. That was very random. Is this the thing? Um, my 
might be up there. Um. Oh, that bit over there. Um. Documents. Ah, treasure maps. Jigs treasure map. What's that one? What's that one? Oh, that one. Yeah, I remember. <laughs> okay. Um. Those trees up there kind of look like they could be that bit. Which means it could be those rocks. Um, whereabouts is that? So that's kind of directly opposite where I'm looking. Like over this bit. Kind of. Uh, I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> this might be wild goose chase. In which case, if it is, I'm not going to include it in the video. <laughs> Let's try get in here. I don't even know what I'm looking for though when I, if, when I find what I'm supposed to be finding. They kind of look like those two rocks might be the whatever it is. Great way to get off your horse, Arthur. Is it something to do with this? And if so, what is it to do with this? This rock? I don't even know what I'm looking for. trying to see like anything that might be interactable. Into that. Can I like climb this rock and get on there and 
Why did it put me all the way over there? I didn't think that's where I was. Yeah. Okay. So now it's daylight, I can actually maybe see what I'm doing a bit. It's gotta be that that lot. to be up higher than I currently am. The rock. Oh, it's there. No. Uh. Hmm. I the wrong thing. <laughs> what is my satchel? Is it literal? Was I meant to go up here? But then down. Is there like a... A path? Maybe? Good idea. Oh, can I get across there? How do I jump? How do I jump? Would it across? Oh, this is a bad idea. Oh, I made it. Can I get back? Oh, that was probably a bad idea. A dead end yet. <laughs> oh, this is such a stupid idea. What am I doing? It's obviously not this. I don't know if I can get back. I'm probably going to kill myself now. Although I might be able to get down. No, that's too far down too. Oh, oh! What? Seriously, that is it? Oh my goodness. How am I going to get back though? What did I even get for that? A pearl necklace and another treasure dock. Back all going, oh yeah, because he said it was a teapot thing, didn't he? I found a treasure. <laughs> uh, where the heck's that? Kind of looks familiar. It looks a bit like this area where I tried to catch a horse when I was going up. Um, where 
was I going? What's this? Oh, Albert's around again. <laughs> um, when I was going up this way, and I was coming through somewhere around here. Where had I been? I'd been here, hadn't I? Yeah, so it was when I was here, and I was going through all of this stuff to go up to wherever that thing is that I went to go and get me. It kind of looks like one of, somewhere I ran through there, but I have no idea where that was. Because that was all like steamian stuff. But I have no idea where that was. I might have to look that one up because I don't have a clue. What's that? Why is that white? Weapons forbidden. What's a reservation? Ooh. Where else was that? I don't know. Hmm. Cause there's no like obvious marker. There was a legendary animal nearby? A wolf or something? I thought. It might be here. It might be here. Maybe. Because that, that popped up when I looked at my map and then I ran away because I was scared I was going to run into something when I was trying to catch a horse. <laughs> so, um, maybe it's there. That's really far away though. Isn't it? It's really far away. So if it is there, I'll do that some other time when I'm up in that area. Maybe, because that's really far off. That's super far. Or I'll ride up there and in between episodes and see about finding it in case uh, it's not actually that. But in the meantime, I'm um, going to head back and do this mission, I think. We found one, if I can get off this bloody rock. How do I get down without killing myself? That's definitely going to kill me. I've got to go back. Oh, how do I do this? Seriously, how are you gonna get over there? That's not possible, right? I'm probably gonna die right now. Ooh, don't don't die before I even have the chance to live, please. Yeah. Oh, I'm not dead! I'm not dead somehow! <laughs> okay, can I survive that bit? I don't know how high up I am, I can't tell. So that's not a tree, is it? Um Maybe I'll eat something. Uh... I'm alive. I'm fine. <laughs> that might be way to my head through them, so it's fine. <laughs> Getty, you didn't see that ungraceful descent, did you? <laughs> you weren't watching that. Uh, cool. Well, that is tricky, that thing. Alright, let's see what Dutch is up to. We've been avoiding this one for ages. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Matthews gave me a message for you. He said when it was convenient to head into oh, Emerald Ranch. Lord. He's looking at a few business things there. Okay. Oh, he'll find something too. He always does. Will you be well now, Mr. Morgan? I'm always well, Miss Grimshaw. Thanks, Susan. Um. So who was that one? Hosea. So why is that one flashing compared to like this one not flashing? Is that a the fact it's yellow means it's a the main quest, right? I kinda wanna go and see.
Um, hello. Can I fast travel? Emerald Ranch. Yeah. Let's just fast travel there. <laughs> okay, see Hosea. That's just getting. We have to wait a bit longer. So we'll get to find out what's going on with this place. That's an interesting way of putting it, James. Uh, no doubt. I do interesting very well. It's trusting I don't do so well. Oh, please. Hi, right, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves? To this clown, what you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Parker. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now you go get that, and then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin by marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. You heard the man, <laughs> let's go rob his cousin. By marriage. <laughs> okay. That's what we're doing then. Um. Really? Really. Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Me? Okay. The other one has been out gallivanting around here. I have. That's what you call it. Clearly, you've recovered from your bear encounter. I didn't think I'd studied that, though. So Could have played that study. better, couldn't you? Thought you wanted me here to show some strong arm. That's usually how it goes. Yes, but you know how this works. Come on, Hosea. That feather's a joke. And that's why he's perfect. He won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches, that's easy money for us. I yeah, I probably wouldn't be right. that much. <laughs> Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus' old crooked cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. Look where you're going. Hosea, get some oh, personal oh. space. Yeah. Oh. So what's the story with Hosea. that Emerald Ranch? You find out anything else? A little. Owner's a nasty type by all accounts. Seamus is sure scared of him. Yeah, that's that's the not saying much. Heard. Something strange about the place. That's also what I've Used I to heard. be a saloon there, general store. Now it's all closed up, but they seem to have money. Sounds worth a look around. For sure. Seamus also mentioned the rancher's daughter a couple of times. Yeah, same as the lady now, I, I used met. used to see her around all the time, but now she never leaves the house. Probably just sweet on her. That what you call finding out a little? Once he opens up, seems Seamus does like to talk. Hopefully not too much. Hey, partner. Hello. Excuse us. Yeah. Must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. 
Oh, I'm gonna mess Let's this see up what on we're I. dealing with. Come on. <laughs> Wait, I don't have any weapons. One second, I've only got my pistol. I just need to get my uh There's the house. See the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Security. Oops. Binoculars, where were they again? <laughs> Anyone around? Yes. Okay. I reckon we can do it now. I'll head over, distract them by putting on a little show while you sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or wait until nightfall. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? Uh, we'll go for the option. Let's do it now. Why not? Sure. All right, then. Don't follow me. Okay. <laughs> Hang back from Jose and sneak Wait into the house. Wait until I have them distracted outside, then sneak into the house. Going around the back. My good man, my good young man. Forty-five dollars worth of stuff. You know what? Oh, here he is. Are you the father of the house? Sure. Pleasure to meet you. I'm just starting to assume you here a bit. You selling something for me? Great. Spinal alignment. What? Spinal alignment. The Lord God Almighty. Or who, whomever built it. But our brains in here, but our souls is in our back. I'm bound. You, sir, you're, you're I'm bound. Clear. I wonder if I should have tried to rub more money. I'm waiting. See if I could see the current quest, but I don't know if I can. Is 
Is there a cabin? It's not telling me to wait anymore. Oh, here he comes. <laughs> you done, Arthur? Yep. yep. Okay, let's grab this stagecoach and get out of here. Turn stagecoach to Emerald Farm. Yeah. I was wondering if I should have shut the chest because I didn't. I left them open. And I shut the one in the. I think you should have been more careful. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. Must have left the dresser open. Yeah, that's what I was thinking when I was going out. I was like, should I be shutting those? So what were you able to lift from the house? Few bits that would have cost me Nothing some too fancy. perfect thing. Well, we need anything we can get right now. This was easier than hunting a thousand pound grizzly anyway. <laughs> yeah, it was. <laughs> no doubt. I won't forget that in a hurry. I'm looking forward to your retelling of that one around the campfire. <laughs> it wasn't the first time Mr. Matthews had stared death in the eye. And as usual, he did not flinch. Yeah, exactly. So how long do you think we're going to stick around here for? Not sure. Here we can't, I suppose. Feels like we're starting to get back on our feet, slowly but surely. Just need to keep at it. Dutch has a new money chest stashed in a safe spot away from camp, but it's a long way from being full. Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn there. This is like taking it into the garage in uh, Grand Tavoy. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. <clears throat> Park that thing in here. Quickly. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse but competent. Here. <laughs> if you. only I had uh, shut the chest and any drawers, I knew I should have. I'll see what I can offer you for them. But I know discreet, the future, then. you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Yeah. Sure. Cause it's a long way away. I'll come back here and have a look around this place to find out what's going on with the daughter another time. <laughs> 